Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to look at how you can add some new credit to your AdWords account in order to get your account up and running again. Just a note on what the Webonks have done. During your online warrant of fitness, we will have added $150 worth of credit. You may have seen that there is more credit in your account, but we use 150 initially for the uses of the two campaigns that we run. So there's $100 for the search network at $10 a day, and there is $50 on the display network for $5 a day. And that runs for, of course, 10 days. You'll need to log into your AdWords account. And there's another tutorial lesson on the campus for you to watch in order to see that. So go to the Webonks campus after WAF and you will see how to log in. In order to add new credit to your account, you'll need to click on the billing tab in the AdWords interface. And in there, you will be able to add credit. And you'll see, as you will have on the previous page, that there is a red ribbon that says your ads aren't showing because your account balance is exhausted. And you can make a payment, so you can click on the link make a payment. You can also click on the blue tab item that is underneath your current balance to make a payment. And you'll also see the amount of credit that has been used for your campaigns. And you can see the campaign activity. The larger number is the display network cost and the smaller number is the search network cost. Just a quick navigation lesson. You're currently in the transaction history. You can click on billing settings or billing profile. If we drill down into billing profile, you can see that you've got the billing ID in case you need to send any information through to Google. Uh, and you've also got the address of your business. You can edit the information inside of the billing profile. If you click on billing settings, you'll see you don't have any available forms of payment. When the Webwonk set up your account, we set all payments to be manual. The reason we do that is that we debit credit from our own account and we don't want to leave those details in there. If you add a new form of payment, we suggest that you use your credit card. Funds transfer has not worked for the Webwonk in the past and in fact has cost us money. The money disappeared into the, the great Google account and it was impossible to get that money back. So just be wary that you may lose your money if you use the direct debit. We really do believe that credit cards are the best way forward. Here you can enter your credit card details and click save. If you go back, you can then change the type of payment that you have. You click on edit and then to manual payments it will now say save because you'll have a form of payment in there, your credit card. And from now on, it will automatically debit your card so that you can keep your ads running. Important to note there, do you want to make manual payments? Do you want to be in control? Or do you want to know that you've set your budget correctly? You know that it's going to cost $350, $500 per month that you're prepared to spend that money. Therefore, you can just make it tick along, you don't have to worry about it, you know your ads are going to be served, you know your credit card's going to be debited, and that's all you need to worry about. It really does come down to your, your budgeting. Can you, can you afford to have that money being taken out of the account every time? Just jumping back to transaction history, if you have loaded a credit card, you can click on make payment. It'll ask you to select the type of credit card. Here, of course, there is no credit card added. You can click on credit card and make a manual payment and you can choose either the last payment or the payment that you want to make. If you click on funds transfer, it'll give you a series of steps that you need to fill out. Again, if you click on review payment, this isn't gonna work because there's no credit card details and there's no valid amount. You'll then go into a confirmation page. It just says, do you really want to spend this money? And you're gonna click yes there. If you have any questions about billing for Google AdWords, please head to the Webwonks Facebook page. That's facebook.com forward slash Webwonks and leave us a message. That way we can get back to it quicker. Alternatively, if you need to contact us now, 0800 932 9665. That's 0800 Webwonks. Thanks for watching.